Oh shit! No visibility! No fucking visibility! Ew! Shit, my hands are freezing though, so I guess I'm gonna crank up my heater to all 70 80 percent now. So I have to take a left, and here I have to yield. I can't see what's coming from there, I have to be very careful. Okay, there you go. Oh, there's a bridge! I didn't even see that! There's a river down there which I can't see, no visibility, like river is all like fog. I just realized I think I should go back so it's been a long time that I'm riding out and I absolutely forgot to fill fuel you know all this COVID-19 and all so I gotta go back fill fuel and come back on this road I have to hold this in a peculiar way because without the pressure being applied on the nozzle head it will not pump fuel so it gets a little tricky when you park the bike this way there you go full tank the foam of the mic i dropped it so my gopro is not responding to commands now because it's too loud when i ride so i have to stop every time i want to respond to commands so i'm going to show you something it's freaking made it dusty you know all these four by fours that go into the forest so check this out so private road don't go it says no shooting hidden homes this side so there are people who have nice homes in there um no shooting as in not it's not video recording look at this my i gotta switch to my revit gloves i haven't broken them in so yeah no shooting as in like because this is a forest this could be hunting area so no shooting really you know so multiple roads i guess that's a private property up there uh whoa this one is too but my google map says this route is six minutes slower let me show you area close to motorized use gopro stop recording Yes, we are going into deeper jungle now, deeper parts of the forest. Uh oh, what the fuck? Dude! Are you serious? <sighs> so I really don't know why this road behind me is closed on the Google Maps. Of course, Google Maps have been showing me wrong closed roads forever. But uh, this lip mask doesn't look good. <laughs> that box over there has like four or five locks. And I might be able to slide my bike through underneath there, but I have to take off all the luggage to do that. Question is, should I do that or should I go around? Because I came half the way, half the way in, and uh, not very happy to see this. 
I wonder if I go straight up. You see that other wide route that I just found? I used Onyx a little bit over here. So I'm in this, this whole green region is the forest. So maybe if I can go up like that and come back down. That will be a big detour though. If I do that, maybe, maybe I can come back here. On this route right now, it says 25 minutes. I don't know what that's going to account for. Or the other option is to go down all the way back onto this white road here. The mosquitoes have started attacking me now. Forest mosquitoes. All right, as you can see, the forest is getting a little dense over here with, there's a water body here, water source for animals, for, it's like a marsh actually, not really. Yeah, it is a water source, but it's a marsh, a forest marsh. Uh, going on an uncertain route now, Google Maps is showing me that blue line but I'm actually detouring somewhere else because that blue line has a forest closure Another closed road huh? This is all wetland again on my side, on my right side. Don't think it. Check this out. I can see it. I can see right there that that road is closed. All right, detour again. I don't know how many of you guys want to be alone in <laughs> a forest like this. Definitely not when it's dark. Oh fuck sake, man! Fuck sake. Can a guy just freaking pass through the forest? You know, if you had a dirt bike, right through there. So I guess I, I don't know what to do. What in the fuck? I gotta go back all the way out of the forest and find a different route. So this is what happens when you try to travel wilderness, not tourist destinations, not, uh, you know, touristy routes, main road to main road, hotel to hotel, you know, you, there's a lot of figuring out that needs time, so let's go and listen to this can you hear it? that's right you can't, it's absolute silence, you can only hear my breath <laughs> actually freaking alone here I hope I can find my route back properly because I think I took one two three detours so let's see hope I remember that count properly you see this is exactly why it was a good thing that I went and fuel tanked up because I had like one bar just one bar Something is dead out here. I don't know if something got hunted by a bear. Because that's the apex predator in this jungle. It's either mountain lion or a bear in the forest of Washington. So I don't know what it is. It's
of sunlight just coming down can you guys see it but of course this freaking road is super dusty but this Jesus fucking hell Leave gate as soon as you found it That's what it says Leave gate as soon as you found it All these private property gates Ew Downhill Downhill it's a gravel What do I do? My off-road ABS isn't off so I'm just gonna brap Do you guys see that? There's a dead animal carcass here. Huge two leg pieces. I don't even want to know how. And I don't know if these are eagles. No, vultures, really small vultures. You see that? The three of them, one in the tree there right one up there one up there they were eating that i'm sure if i if i just ride off they'll come and you know i don't want to disturb it let me just ride off Ah oh man, this is where you need electric bikes. You gotta be silent when you wanna see wildlife. I doubt it'll be there now, but let's see. Keep looking to the left, you might see it. You see it? Meek me. There is two. There's one more. Right there. I didn't even notice. Are there more? <laughs> 